I feel sad and I feel hurt that it has to come to an end. If I continue with the bookshop the way I'm doing it, I'll go in debt. I've retired, you see. So where am I going to get the money? That's the reality of it. I'm basically closing the bookshop because there is no more crowd. It's not MCO is part of it, but uh, prior to that, we were just, uh, like I said, it was just on passion. I'm not talking about any logical businessman would have closed it down for a long time ago. Yeah, I'm, I'm old school, so I thought, you know, we'll rent books at seven ringgit, you know, for a month. Where can you get that? We resume back on the 4th of uh, May. And on the 6th or 7th of May, we we'll received a legal letter to say that we are supposed to pay rentals even when we were not operating. And that was where I said, enough is enough. I, I think people, if people are not compassionate, what can you do? I don't have a choice. And then they came up and said that, uh, okay, we are coming up, uh, we are giving you 20%, uh, why don't you stay around? I, I said, no, I've made up my mind. I don't think so because my tenancy is up for renewal. They say, if you are not going to renew your tenancy, then you've got to pay the whole amount. I think there's a lot of, uh, there's a lack of uh, compassion by, by management also in, in a certain way. I feel very, very sad that the shop is closing. I personally wished that maybe somebody bought over so that you know we could this can still continue like at least I could still come or the other regular customers could still come and rent books I feel very sad and I think I will miss the smell of the books yeah and you will meet a lot of different kind of people people who read and people who don't read it's very different Why can't they just get another shareholder to just see it through? I mean, if it's the, just the MCO, Malaysia has a lot of readers and I mean, things like Big Bad Wolf, you have a lot of people buying. But I think there's an opportunity to really just uh, inculcate a, a reading habit. Nah. So, so sad, lah, very sad. I'm in love with this shop. I think my whole family is in love with this shop. It's part of the family. I don't make a living out of this. It's passion. And when you have passion, it's different. Leaving this place is not easy. One of the greatest things I love about the bookshop was being able to meet people. Bookshops are very special. Whenever I go overseas, I look around for bookshops, hoping to get a bargain, you know, bring back some books here, back to Malaysia. It's sad, but uh, at the end of the day, it's, it's reality, you see. The reality is that you have to sustain it, if not, you'll get sunk. <laughs>